So ladies, this is the tapered bob. And one of the things among many things that we paid really close attention to when we were designing it uh, was the angles. And as you know, we paid attention to the angles, we really wanted to pay attention to how it looked in the back, how it read like in the nape area. Um, so often like the dead giveaway on a short wig is like what's going on in the nape. So we were really careful to make that look as natural as we could. Um, additionally, we have been getting so many questions about what is a pinch of salt. And so for us, a pinch of salt is just when we add some gray highlights, some kind of silver highlights to any of the units that we make. And the reason why we do that is, you know, some people just like a little bit of gray, but a lot of our clients who are just graying around the edges can get away with, um, you know, a, a wig that is mostly black, but just has a little bit of gray highlight to sort of bridge between the black and some of the gray hair that you tend to get like around your temples. So again, with this unit, we, um, the, this model again has no leave out because uh, this is a, a bald mannequin. And um, this bald mannequin doesn't have one, a, um, a wig cap either. Uh, so this wig can be used with leave out or it can be used like we have it here with no leave out. And again, I'm just gonna just snatch this off of her to show what it's like uh, when you um, don't have any leave out and you don't even have any hair. Um, this can be used on people who have hair, but again, you have the option of making it fully protective because you don't have to have any leave out.